Aparna and welcome to Aparna's Magic. Today I'm going to show you how to make aloo capsicum masala. My style. So let's get started. For that we need two medium sized chopped capsicum. Here I take two medium sized boiled potatoes. This is roasted ground flour or roasted besan. This is tomato puree, one cup. This is turmeric powder or haldi powder. This is Kashmiri red chili powder. This is jeera powder or cumin powder. This is ginger garlic paste. This is chopped onion. Here I take two medium sized onion. This is cumin seeds or jeera seeds and red dry chilies. This is chopped coriander leaves or chopped dhaniya patta. This is garam masala powder. This is hing or asafoetida and this is ghee. Our oil is nicely heated up so we will put red dry chilies around 3 to 4 and 1 tablespoon of cumin seeds or jeera seeds. Let them crackle. Now add 1 teaspoon of asafoetida or hing into it. Add 1 tablespoon of ginger garlic paste. Mix it well and let it cook for a while. Our onions are nicely brown, so at this stage we will put one cup of tomato puree into it. Add one tablespoon of Haldi powder or turmeric powder, 1 tablespoon of Kashmiri red chilli powder, 1 tablespoon of jeera powder or cumin powder, salt to taste, add sugar to balance it. Now mix them all. Let it cook for a while. It has been simmering for 5 minutes now. So in this stage, we will put 1 tablespoon of Bhunahua Besan or roasted gram flour. Mix it nicely. This will thicken the gravy. Now add capsicum. potatoes put little bit of water if it is too thick to handle Let it cook for a while. It has been simmering for another 5 to 7 minutes now. So, in this stage, we will put 1 teaspoon of garam masala powder, chopped coriander leaves or chopped dhania patta, and 1 teaspoon of ghee into it. Now mix it gently. Look at this. How gorgeous it is looking now. And 
you are done. Stay tuned for more recipes and please subscribe my channel.